good morning we are from svs embedded the project title name is called a reconfigurable low power mixed signal for portable ecg monitoring system so in this project we are using an arm 7 lpc 2148 and we are using one power supply section in 16 cross 2 lcd display character lcd display and one hotbit module we are using and one body temperature lm that lm 35 temperature sensor and one here we are using one ecg module and one max 232 is a level converter voltage level stabilization ic and one gsm a gprs module we are using sim 900 and one hc05 bluetooth module and this is my entire block diagram section so here I am using one power source, regulator power supply, step down transformer, bridge rectifier, filter capacitor and one LM7805 regulator I am using. So he, here we have a two pots, one is patient monitoring unit and one is a doctor's monitoring unit. Patient monitoring unit we are connected with the bluetooth dongle or internal bluetooth of the laptop and we are displaying the data onto the lab view in the form of uh, graphical symbol or in the form of waves and we are seeing the output data the doctor is at far from the uh, city or any area so doctors they have to see the data onto the team viewer software using a doctor's unit so we are taking the input source from here to the username that is called in the type team viewer we have a username password and that should be given to the doctors doctor will see the output data continuously so here we are using a hardware section we are using power supply 16 cross 2 lcd display lpc 2148 32-bit microcontroller and one temperature sensor ecg sensor and one hotbit module gsm modem and one bluetooth module so max 232 ic and i am using a keel microvision 4 the uh, integrated development environment tool and one embedded c software for the programming and i am using a flash magic to dumping the program onto the controller so i'm i'm going to get patient monitoring temperature heartbeat and ecg so here i want to i'm going to see the output on the monitoring called team viewer so tell me the team viewer id so this is the patient monitoring unit and pay, doctor can uh, see the output on the unit so here control t so this is the block diagram window and this is the output window so doctor can continuously see the data so let us go in for the hardware unit so instead of hardware we are seeing the output onto the pc so i'll explain so coming into the hardware we are using an uh, 230 input step down transformer 9 volts output ac with 750 milliamps current so why we are using the transformer means we required a huge power source so that's why we are using the transformer otherwise if you can go for the adapters battery adapters that is also not a problem for a variable travel purpose so here we are a two pin element it is connected to the bridge rectifier filter capacitor 7805 regulator and it is giving the 5 volts output power supply unit that is called the LED so here we are using an ARM7 LPC2148 32 bit microcontroller having two ports port 0 and port 1 total 64 pin IC QDIP quadrupole dual in package line we have a total two ports port 0 port 1 port 2 0 consists of 0 0.02 0 0.31 port 1 consists of P1.16 to P1.31 total uh, 48 pin input output bidirectional port 1 port 0 consists of uh, 32 pin port 1 consists of 16 pin it can execute 16 bit architecture and as well as 32 bit architecture and here and here we have a uh, 12 megahertz crystal crystal is the heart of the circuit for the controller to generate the clock pulses to the internal cpu to run the program and here we have an one isp button and one reset button isp in system programming when we want to dump the program onto the controller must and should we have to press the isp and press and release the reset then only the program will be dumped 
through UAT0. So here we have uh, in ARM processor we have two ports one is UAT0 and UAT1. In UAT0 it is connected to the Bluetooth module and UAT1 it is connected to the GSM modem. That depends upon your requirement you can change UAR, uh, your devices. And here port 0 it is connected to the 16 cross 2 LCD display character LCD display whatever the process is going on to the controller that should be displayed on the LCD so here we are using an uh, 16 cross 2 LCD display in the upper we are using T for temperature H for heartbeat E for ECG and here we have an one max 232 is there level converter voltage level stabilization purpose we are using so in our project we are using three sensors one is called LM35 temperature sensor precious temperature sensor minus 55 degree centigrade to 150 degree centigrade it is ranging okay now so here uh, that uh, UAT so ADC and ADC 1 it is connected to the ECG model this this is LM324 based operational amplifier circuit we are amplify the signals coming from the electrodes called whatever we are taking from left hand right hand right leg the data will be taken to the three inputs and one output should be given to the ADC that ADC it is connected to the uh, port P029 third channel and the data will be seen on to the LCD and here we are using one heartbeat module so this is an IR sensor base IR transmitter and IR receiver based so when when we are putting the finger on finger trip so the data will be IR transmitter received of the blood circulation high low pulses then it is given to the LM358 based operational amplifier circuit whenever the signals coming from high low pulses that accurate high low pulses give, given to the port pin P1.7 it is connected to the heartbeat sensor unit heartbeat sensor input so when the microcontroller we are taking up accurate 30 pulses means half of the time we are taking that individual calculating the pulses and we are given the time period and in that time period most significant values and we are giving the output to the LCD display and as it is we are sending the data to the UART0 uh, through HC05 Bluetooth module 9600 baud rate and 2.4 gigahertz frequency trans receiver pair and the data will be sending to the same uh, laptop with a Bluetooth module and we are using one GSM SIM 900 uh, send GPRS module we are using and uh, here uh, you can connect uh, uh, micro SIM card and big SIM card that depends upon bridge rectifier filter capacitors and one LM3117 this uh, uh, GSM module required 4.75 volts so that's why we are here we, we have in four LM317 so regulatorizing so here the network LED and one ring LED so this is an entirely G GSA module okay so when we are going to the output section must and should we have to wear the parameters so we have to put the finger and we have to wear the variables so wait for two seconds start a low sensor mixed signal system flash on heartbeat ah idhar on karo idhar idhar on karo oh on karo sir जब से वो आ रहा है ना, जब से वो कंटिन्यूटी था। हम्म, अभी आ। हम्म। वहाँ पर नहीं है। प्रॉपर नहीं आया स्टॉप आ रहा सर ईसीजी आ रहा आठ बिट आठ बिट आ रहा 
like yes 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 so actually uh, that time we are uh, unable to read that data <laughs> yeah right but ye yeah, close Hmm. So we have to see the data here. The monitoring unit, unit also. Either, either we call doctors monitoring. Doctors monitoring unit. so actually uh, i am only person so that is not uh, this is actually we are getting the value how this is the correct way so we have to get same values already we are checked in lot, lot of experiments so this is an uh, thermometer and this is the garage and this is the ecg monitoring unit actually we have to get the values in this format only so i have removed my my clips and everything so if the temperature increases above 50 degree so we will get the output show me your phone so so in this so upper one so if the ecg above it will get the alert and if the temperature 105 and above we will get the sms alert so this is an portable ecg monitoring system using bluetooth thanking you if there is any doubt let me know to svs embedded